Hello, horror fans, and welcome once again to the Horror Obese. It's day 12 of my 31 Horrors of October. And tonight's movie is... Joyride. Uh, Joyride stars... Steve Zahn, Paul Walker... Uh, Lili Sobeski. I don't think I didn't butcher that. Like I said, I'm illiterate. So, Joyride. This is a movie about three friends going, um, uh, road trip. Well, one of them decides to, um, tease a trucker by the name of Rusty Nails. And he starts uh, calling himself Candy Cane. And that's how this charade begins. Rusty Nails finds them and starts putting them into these um, like tricky situations where um, they either survive or they don't. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Now this is a very good movie. Um, this movie came out I'm going to say in the 90's I believe this movie came out around the same time Jeepers Creepers came out and um, I really enjoyed it I didn't see it in theaters I could have but I didn't um, I know a couple of friends of mine went and saw it in theaters they loved it I waited till they came out on DVD I believe or it was it was still had VHS. I forget what format I watched it. I mean, tonight I watched it in VHS, as you can see. And I really, really enjoyed the whole movie. I thought it was pretty, pretty cool. It was an awesome premise and everything. Um, to my surprise, uh, reading the credits in the back, um, this was co-written by J. J. Abram. Yeah. Small world. I did not know that. Um, but it's a good movie. If you haven't seen it, for sure check it out. I'm pretty sure you'll find something you like from it. I know this movie spawned two other sequels and also spawned some others, some other uh, vehicular monsters out there. I think one of them was. Let's see if I get this right. Monster Man? The guy driving this Bigfoot? Um, nothing new to the genre. I mean, we had already uh, the car. We had Christine. Um, but uh, at the time, I mean, fans really enjoyed it. It's a good movie, you know, and we'll start in uh, the late Paul Walker. Uh, I think this is one of one of his first movies, or his starting up movies, before he started uh, getting his fame in The Fast and the Furious. Um, but, other than that, uh, this is a very good movie. As I said, if you haven't seen it, check it out. And if you've seen it before, give it another shot. Obviously, you saw it for a reason, because you liked it. Uh, I don't believe I've seen any of the sequels. Uh, I guess there are hits and miss on the sequels, but I'll try and see if I can find them, or maybe look for them in the streaming media. But on that note, hope you like what you see. Thanks for watching, and if you haven't subscribed to hear more of my shenanigans, and I will see you tomorrow, day 13. Thank you for watching.